Surprise, motherfucker. What's up? So many things I should probably talk about. Um, what I am talking about is... Well, I've got some chalk reviews in the works from people. Um, so that's exciting. Um, RPG Pundit is going to release his... Chult Chartreuse Shadows review uh, pretty soon, I think. And then Nick Beardia is going to slowly work their way through um, to Fuchsia Malays and then Chartreuse Shadows. Uh, I really liked what they did with uh, Chult and the Good Sumerian. I've got, if you look on the blog, uh, and I'll put a link in the description below for um, the blog post where there's uh, like an in-between thing um, between issues one and two coming out later this month for uh, the webcomic Under Fuchsia Sky. And uh, so that's exciting. So go check that out. Uh, and then if you haven't seen issue one, see that. And I hope you look forward to issue number two. Uh, I might do some uh, crowdfunding for that um, as a Kickstarter down the road, uh, maybe in a couple months. Right now, I am just finishing up the revision of Advanced Game Mastering Like a Fucking Boss. And then I'll hopefully I'll get the vast majority of the my own personal revision done tonight and then i can send it over to the proofreaders um also tonight and uh or tomorrow morning and then they have a week to do their thing and look it over and find what i missed and typos and grammatical errors and things that uh you know don't make sense and then when I get it back, uh, it goes to layout, and then, you know, um, then it gets released. And, I mean, drive through will have to vet it, of course. And I think it'll go through with, it'll pass with flying colors. I think it will. Um, you know, I touch on not just game mastering proper but it's kind of you know a journey it's kind of autobiographical uh it includes you know references of course to you know movies and tv shows and and books and things like that but it also includes just things that i've learned over the years um from all you know avenues so yeah we'll see we'll see what happens there i suppose if drive through has too much of a problem with it and i have to take out too much then i'll just upload it to big geek emporium i suppose uh we'll see we'll see where they come down time will tell um and then when that's out to people and then, yeah, I'll do another Kickstarter probably to, to keep funding Under Fuchsia Sky, the webcomic for Chult. And um, I've got some more exciting things for Chult coming down the road. Probably we'll do another Chult game jam later this year, maybe just before VengerCon in July. Uh, so that's exciting. So also, here's my pitch. It's... A very small, intimate gaming convention uh, of, for the most part, like-minded people that are not interested at all in, in wokeness uh, or social justice warrioring. Um, and it focuses specifically on old-school OSR and traditional role-playing games. So there won't be any board games or um, computer games or card games. Or, you know, there is not going to be like this giant like dealer's hall or whatever. You know, we don't have marketing from the big companies that, you know, or like 
a live walkthrough escape room dungeon or you know any of that gimmicky stuff it's just a bunch of people i was gonna say guys but obviously it's open to women too um getting together and playing the games they love maybe playing some new things that they try out um and i'll be there of course game mastering we'll talk about gaming throughout when we're not actually playing um you know we'll sit at the bar and, and hang out and drink together we'll share meals and it'll just be that's what the first convention was like uh just a lot of camaraderie a lot of trading stories and insights and learning about slightly different avenues of gaming and sharing what we love uh already and yeah just having a great time playing the game i mean that's what it's all about just playing the game right it's not about activism and it's not about politics and it's not about um all these other things surrounding it that you might see at a normal gaming convention this is just about the gaming and that's it so yeah there's still tickets available topping out at 100 just like last time uh get your ticket today it's madison wisconsin in july all weekend friday saturday sunday details like i said in the description below um i think that's it and hopefully in a few days i'll make another video if you have a topic in mind shoot otherwise if there's something going on in the culture i'll talk about that all right see ya